All right, welcome back to my channel. Um, over the last couple of weeks, I've been enjoying shooting these types of videos. A lot of coaches have sent me emails, sent me texts, asking for more of this type of uh, material. And if you missed the last couple uh, videos I've posted, they're similar to this. They go deep into numbers of your business. And today is all about lifetime customer value. Now, what I mean by that is really simple. It's when you sign up one client, how long are they in your program, right? This is a question when I ask coaches, most coaches do not know the answer because they don't track all the money in their business. Now, I will tell you, if you have a low customer value, all right, low lifetime customer value, which I think would be like two months or three months, then your business is always going to struggle because every two or three months you're having to find new clients to replace the ones that leave. And one of the things I teach, if you follow my YouTube channel <clears throat> for really any amount of time, I've talked a lot about having a uh, 12 month agreement in place <clears throat> with your clients. So this way, when you sign up one client, you know, you can guarantee they're in your program for a year and I can show you on the spreadsheet here what the differences are with coaches that do this and coaches that don't do it. And again, if you have a low lifetime customer value, expect to not grow your business the way that you should because you're always having to replace clients, like clients who leave with clients who come in every three months. It becomes this roller coaster cycle. You get excited when you sign someone up and then someone drops off and then you have to sign someone else up. That is a recipe for disaster in this industry, right? So what we want to do, right, is I'm going to go through this piece by piece. And what I would tell you, if you want this spreadsheet, I can send it to you. Um, just send me a text message at 210-960-5771. If you can't remember my phone number, go down in the description. You can see it there. And if you want more coaching with your business, go to my website, buildmysportsbiz.com. All right, let's get in the spreadsheet. So now <clears throat> I am basing this spreadsheet off of one price, right? Which is $300 a month. Now, if you're not charging $300 a month, um, that's okay. I'm basing this because I would say the average coach that I end up working with they either charge like 200, 300, or 400 per month. So I'm picking the middle here, I'm picking 300. I think that's a an average price, and this could be for um, either private training or group training. A lot of coaches that I work with, they end up charging $300 a month or more for group training. So I'm using this for either model, group training or one-on-one -on -one training, right? Now, with that being said, uh, top left corner, number of clients at $300 a month. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 10. And then I skip to 20, 40, and 60. Now, obviously, if you get to 20, 40, or 60, at that point, you shouldn't be running one-on-one -on -one training, right? That sounds like common sense. I just want to make sure that's clear before I continue. Now, you'll see the three-month LCV. That means that on average, your clients are staying for three months and then they leave. All right. The only way to track that is you look at how many clients you have, right? And you see, you track all the money. You see, all right, how long has each person stayed? And we take an average of that. That is your lifetime customer, uh, really value of how long they're in your program. And then you look at the money and say, well, on average, this is how much money each client is paying. Right, so I'm taking the average here of $300 a month, the average person staying for three months. So that one client is investing $900 over three months, all right? 300 times three months. That's where I'm getting this number. So it just gets, it gets bigger and bigger here, 1800. So all I'm doing really is just multiplying 900, right? Times three, three more months, which would be one more customer, right? That'd be, or sorry, I multiply it by two because we take 900, that's the value of one client over three months, and we multiply it by two, all right, to get 1,800. So that's the value of two clients that are in your program for three months at $300 each, all right? Very simple. So the math just continues here. Now, the reason why I created this is because this is the amount of money you probably normally make 
if you have clients that are in your program for three months. If you have 10 clients, all right, total over those three months, you're making $9,000, right? The math is very simple. When we get to 20 clients, all right, you're making more, obviously, 40, 60, all right? Then when we switch over to a longer agreement with your clients, and this is why like a lot of coaches that I work with, they end up really making their business so much better, not because they add clients, it's because they switch how they run their business. And one switch can make a monumental difference, especially if you have 10 or more clients, right? And here's what it is, uh, where it says 12 months LCV here, all right? Now, instead of this one client spending $900, they're spending $3,600, right? And that's because they're in your program for three months, or sorry, for 12 months at $300 per month, right? And what I want you to do is when you get this spreadsheet, I want you to label out what the difference in revenue here is, right? And what we'll see, what we, what we identify is the difference gets massive as we go further and further down. But even just with one uh, switch here, taking it from a three-month commitment to a 12-month commitment, if we take 3,600 and we minus 900, all right, that's 2,700, all right, in the difference in revenue. That is huge just for one client, right? That's just for one client, all right? So again, that number gets bigger and bigger, all right? But what we see here is the lifetime customer value of all of your clients, all right, goes up by just a huge number once we get to like, I would say once we get to like right here, all right, when we get to three, there's a, just a huge difference here, all right? And then it just steadily goes up and up and up. And the more clients you have, obviously, when we switch over from like a three month or a month to month agreement to a 12 month, either paid in full, or they do like three payments over three months, or maybe like a, a quarterly payment, you end up collecting way more money per customer, all right? And I mean, it's, it's huge. Otherwise, what we're doing is we run an unsustainable business where maybe we have a really solid three months here and we're at, uh, let's say we're at 20 clients, all right? But let's say the next month, six clients leave. Well, guess what? You Now are, you're losing money, right? Compared to what you did those, those first three months. And then with this model here, it's you're guaranteed to have the income because you're having your clients sign agreements. That is why when you handle your business like a business, you end up making way more money, right? It's, it's pretty simple, right? And when we have clients who commit to longer periods of time, they end up spending more money in your business. And I know that sounds like common sense, but oftentimes coaches need to see this on a spreadsheet, right? You need to see it on a spreadsheet. So what I recommend doing is first look at your business and say, all right, how long is each client in my program? And what is the amount of money that they're spending in my program on average? That is your lifetime customer value for uh, your clients. Then if you, if you take that number, right, and you multiply that number times four, right? That should be your new lifetime customer value without adding any new clients if you switch over to 12 month agreement, all right? And the way I got that number four is three months is that's one quarter during the year, all right? So if, if you take uh, $900 times four, uh, that's gonna be $3,600, all right? There's four quarters. Right. So I hope that makes sense. And when you make that subtle change in your business, you're without working harder, without even getting any more clients, your business is way more profitable. Right. I hope this makes sense. If you have questions about this, if you need help going from like either month to month and you're scrambling to keep your clients to over a 12 month type of program, reach out to me. I do this like clockwork with coaches that I work with. Um, you can either get my help one-on-one -on -one or you can join our group coaching program. This is what we do, right? I had one client last year without adding one client, right? Because he wasn't trying to add any clients, really. He was just trying to maintain what he was doing. He had 50 clients, right? And before we started working together, 
every month it was like he was trying to get new people to join because some were leaving and he did not have everyone super committed once we put this commitment in place he had everyone sign a 12-month agreement he maintained 50 clients and his business ended up making like fifty thousand more dollars that year than the previous year right and he wasn't working harder right he wasn't worried about where his clients were going they were all signed up to his program right that is a huge difference fifty thousand dollars without working harder right i think any coach would take that all right so reach out to me 210-960-5771 if you like this video and you want more videos like this subscribe to my channel i'll keep the videos coming